the program was introduced to me by Leon Woods at um, Claremont Graduate University. And one of the things that uh, everybody knows and that we've been talking about for so many years that the young black boy is the little man on the totem pole when it comes to success in school. We felt that this was one of the ways that we could help. We need to expose our kids to different things that are available. Uh, they need to see people in high places and doing big things that look like them. They just need to have a thirst for education. And so all of these things come only by being around other people and knowing what's really going on and being introduced to new things into their lives. It's just something that uh, the, the schools have to get involved in. And everybody's talking about it, but they're not doing anything. So the math collaborative, as far as I can see, is the one that's doing the best job, and we are successful. When LeBron first uh, attended Jordan High School in the ninth grade, he was more shy, didn't want to connect with too many people. Although he wanted to stay in that shell, Ms. Robinson wasn't having it. LeBron has been doing great things um, privately on his own. He does a lot of things, and he actually got hired through the program um, to tutor students in elementary school he has become well-rounded in many ways. This has been great for him, but he's very good. He's doing well. I am very proud. I'm so proud of this program. One thing that, you know, I kind of, you know, got out of Mac Collaborative is about persistence and consistency. Consistency, like uh, my grades slipped and I know, they knew that I was capable and, you know, they kind of pushed me to just keep on going and not falling over. And that's something I'm taking into consideration this year, so I'm doing better. And, it, and my grades show it. My son was getting an F in Spanish. Not really doing so good. He said, you know, I don't know anything about it, you know. Um, I go in there, I don't know what's going on. So I said, you know, well, you need to start going to see Ms. Robinson. And he said, okay, now he's getting a C plus, almost a B. So when he goes to the classroom, you know, he just stays on top of his stuff so that he could complete the work so he don't have to deal with anything else. I was a participant. I got recruited in eighth grade from Hamilton. All I cared about was sports. All I cared about was basketball. And Ms. Robinson did that. High school alone, I went through literally everything. And so like this program, it was like a security type deal. For one, I had a 2.0 coming into high school. When I met Ms. Robinson, I believe the following year I had a 3.8. It's easy to see what happened and how I got there. And it was by having someone with this foundation of what it takes with the discipline, with the right attitude, with the right heart, et cetera, to push people who wasn't gonna push them at home. I grew up in a foster care. I beat those odds, so does that really matter? No, but if I didn't have this program, those statistics, everything they talk about will be in play. They're talking African-American men that don't usually go to college. And so I think this program is one of a kind. The thing that most inspires me is seeing their success, uh, seeing that they don't understand their potential and they don't understand that all those skills and resources inside of them will just blossom if they had someone to push them and to believe in them. Um, it impacted me a lot. Um, it helped me with my organizational skills, um, my math skills. You know, to meet more people is like kind of cool, so help me socialize more. I wouldn't be in the math collaborative if it wasn't for my parents. They're helping me to succeed more than what my parents can manage. I think our partnership with Cal State Long Beach has been just invaluable because there's so many resources there. We also need to expand this program for African-American students primarily because there's only one and it's on boys. They need to be more if we're gonna make African-American students successful.